Christy with your weekly update for the week of October 29th. Tomorrow we will be having a groundbreaking ceremony for the Public Safety Building. It's going to be right here across from the City Hall Complex at 555 West Walker and it's going to begin at 10 a.m. in the morning. Information about that and about the entire project is available on our website at leakcity.com. And then on Thursday we will be having a dedication ceremony for Eastern Regional Park. That's on November 1st at 1 o'clock p.m. Information about that is also available on our website. Now the park and the building is already open, so you can find out a little bit about the new hours there and also some of the programs that are offered there as well. I would also like to invite everyone to our Veterans Day ceremony that's going to be taking place on Monday, November 12th um, at the Sportsplex here, Sportsplex here in Lake City, right over um, off, of, off of 96. Now if you're interested in participating in that, this is a great way to honor our servicemen and women and our veterans. We will be having the Clear Creek High School Choir there as well as a, a guest speaker and we will also be having our police department and fire department participate in that ceremony as well. So come on out for that event. We will also be unveiling a statue that will go in our Veterans Memorial area at the park. So to find out more about that, log onto our website and check out the calendar. And finally, I want to let you know about one more thing. We will be having a public hearing to discuss our garbage contract um, and it, we'll talk about the uh, difference in rates for residential and commercial customers. So if you're interested in participating in that, you can go to our website as well to find out details about that meeting. It's going to be coming up on November 8th. And one more thing, I want to let you know that the fire department is now accepting Toys for Tots for the Toys for Tots program. Now, you can drop off your toys at Fire Station 1 um, starting now through December 14th. So if you're interested in a way of giving back to the community and helping children in need, please participate in that program. Again, you can find more information about that on the fire department webpage. Until next time, have a great week.